Hey Gray! Welcome back to my channel everyone. Today I want to show you guys how to make erasing slime. So I really hope you guys enjoy this video. If you do, make sure to click the like button. Also comment down below suggesting what videos you guys want to see. Thank you guys so much for watching and let's go ahead and get straight on to this video. So the very first thing we're going to need for this DIY is high polymer eraser. Now high polymer eraser is the only one that is going to work for this because I have tried this with just the regular pink erasers and it doesn't work as well as the high polymer does. So what I'm doing here is I took a blank paper and I'm just going to start erasing nothing. Just erase, erase until you get a bunch of shavings and then when you collect enough we're going to move on to the next step. Once you have collected a good amount of eraser shavings, we're just going to put that into a container and we're actually going to put lotion in this. I'm just taking some regular moisturizing lotion. It doesn't have to be a certain brand and we're going to squirt a few little um, squirts, two or three pumps and then we're going to mix this together. The good thing about this kind of eraser is that it's so soft so when you shave it down and then you add lotion it bonds together and it creates kind of like a play-doh like consistency. So once all the shavings stick together into a little ball I'm going to go ahead and put this in another container and I'm going to also add some Elmer's glue to this. I'm adding glue not only so it could bond more but to give it more erasing, um, I don't know how to explain this, but it will erase more if you know what I mean. And I'm also adding some food dye just to give it some color. Once you have mixed that, you're going to notice it's really chunky. And just a quick tip, the more eraser shavings you have, the better this is going to work. Moving on to the next step, we're also going to add some cornstarch to this and I want this to be really thick, that's why I'm adding my cornstarch. So go ahead and add some, mix it around and there's not exact measurements to this, you're just going to add as you go. To give it some elasticity, I'm also going to add a little bit of liquid starch or just some plain old detergent or you can use borax and we're going to mix this together, knead it like you would do with any other slime and then put it back into the cornstarch because we want this to be thick. You don't want it to be like actual slime where it's almost like wet. This is supposed to be thick and stretchy, almost like gum. After kneading it a lot with cornstarch, it's going to get really ugly and you're going to think you're about to fail at this but do not give up. Mine turned out really like bad and then I just added some glue to it and the glue is actually going to make it stretchier. So if you feel like it's completely falling apart and crumbling, just add a little bit more glue to it and it will slowly come together. Add a little bit more of that liquid starch or detergent and bam, there you have it. There is your erasing putty or erasing slime. And I will admit that it's a little bit tedious, but once you have it, you know, you're good to go. And I'm going to show you guys me erasing because this actually works. It might not work as strong as an eraser does, but it does the job. And that's basically it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to click that like button, comment down below your suggestions, and subscribe if you are not. Thank you guys so much for watching. Like I said, I love you guys so much, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!